Hi everyone, bonjour, anin, salam alaikum. As our community and the global community work to respond to the rapidly changing nature of COVID-19, I commit to continuing to update you here on my social media platforms uh, as the information comes in. Today, I want to give you an update on what my team and I have been up to, what our federal government's doing, uh, and to take the opportunity to, to thank those who are on the front lines of this work, including my colleagues here in Ottawa. Uh, many thanks to those in Peterborough, Kawartha, and across the country who've taken the time, particularly over the past 72 hours, to speak with my team and I. These conversations have been incredibly helpful in helping to ensure that our government's response meets the needs and the realities of some of the most vulnerable people in communities across the country. The Prime Minister announced earlier today additional measures we were taking uh, to keep Canadians safe and to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Uh, and and uh, he asked snowbirds, uh, Canadians and permanent residents abroad, to come home. Uh, and if you need help coming home, uh, we're going to provide you with the supports to get you home. Uh, we also know that the best thing that Canadians can do right now is to practice uh, good hygiene, uh, hand washing, self-monitoring, social distancing, and self-isolating uh, when it's called for. Uh, we also know that social isolating comes at an economic cost, whether you're a business, uh, a worker, uh, your family's income uh, is going to be affected. And we want you to know uh, that we're working very hard. We'll be making announcements soon uh, that will help alleviate some of those anxieties because we don't want anybody risking going to work because they are afraid of um, making their ends meet, whether it's with rent or other necessities. Thank you to all the healthcare workers, everybody on the front lines of this, public health officials, including our own Dr. Rosanna Salvatera, to those who are caring for our elders and seniors, like my mother are, we appreciate you. We're gonna look after you by making sure that we all do our part to bend the curve. I know we're gonna get through this and that we're gonna come out on the other side of this stronger because we're gonna do it with community, with compassion, and with kindness. My team and I are going to continue to update you. Take care of each other, everyone. Talk to you soon.